allowed kids to be in an environment where they're able to learn. Um, I was able to uh, find information about um, students taking away uh, guns from teachers um, because they, um, I guess, they don't place them correctly or um, children um, just um, get curious and they find a way to um, make their way to things like um, guns and um, other things like right here it says uh, Corbin Kent, um, the Huffington Post, and an under publicized study that appeared in the journal uh, Pediatrics Pediatri in uh, 2001. And Jeffrey Jackman and a group of his associates asked uh, 29 groups of two um, <coughs> boys, most of whom um, were 10 years old, uh, to wait for 15 minutes in a room with a uh, glowing mirror and two water pistols. Um, and an actual .380 caliber handgun were partially concealed in various locations in the room. And the handgun was triggered to make the sound of discharge when the trigger was pulled. That was sufficient force. And 48 of the and 64 boys found the handgun. And 30 boys handled the gun. And 16 boys pulled the trigger. And approximately half of the boys who found the gun and thought it was a toy. So, um, the most up-to-date FBI homicide data indicates that um, ch um, children's death is a total of um, 1,448 for uh, 2010. Out of those, um, 165 of those deaths were in the hands of other children. And then, like I mentioned before, uh, kids' brains are still developing. In the first five years of uh, life, your child's brain develops more faster than any other time in their life. The early experiences um, your childhood has and the things he sees, hears, touches, smells, and sees uh, stimulate his brain and create um, millions of connections. Um, this is um, the foundation of their learning. So uh, growing up and living around guns in school can affect them in a negative way. Uh, they can catch bad behaviors and increase child death. Uh, can occur, and um, like I said it before, uh, 165 deaths were in children. And then um, going off to um, teachers accidentally pulling the triggers as well. Um, but here I found some data on the Huffington Post as well, but by uh, Nina Sipkin that. Um, on July 11, 2015, uh, death of a student at the Sangona Model School in Pakistan occurred. A teacher at a private um, school was cleaning his pistol in the staff room while it fired a bullet by accidentally hitting the student and it um, killed him instantly. So then I go off um, Indiana uh, police. She's running for a uh, sheriff accidentally shot himself for the second time in his career. If, um, if uh, <laughs> professionals accidentally shoot themselves, uh, would you make it and uh, think that um, those teachers who uh, get the training for about four to six hours um, would be qualified for this? Okay.